Boy, do I feel dizzy. Where are we? Oh, look who's here. I didn't expect to see you guys. Rouge! Shadow! Hi. Long time no see. This is the distant future, far removed from our own timeline. The future? Then that means Eggman's machine can control time! Eggman's got some nerve dropping us here. Now, how can we get back to our own time? You need a space-time rift, but this requires a lot of energy. I see. You mean using your Chaos Control will... Yes, but that alone is insufficient. Okay, Shadow. It looks like we need to work together. Hello, everybody. It's -a me, Kutubo, and now I'm playing Sonic 2 Fast 6. So we're playing as Shadow the Hedgehog in Crisis City. And we're basically doing the same, the exact same path as him, I mean as, as Sonic. But this time we're doing the vehicle stunt. But I think this time this is going to be a fun one because the, the stages are bigger and... Whoa, did I just charge up the booster? So this, this is perfect for the vehicles. I think, I think I somehow just turned up the booster. I don't know how though. And ironically, this is much faster than just playing as than playing as Shadow the Hedgehog because she is so slow. Okay, gotta be careful. Gotta be careful. Man, if only I had a bit more control on that car, or more, or I mean monster truck. Is it a monster truck? I think it is. Well, let's play in the old-fashioned way. The Shadow Way. Alright, and just ignore them. Just going up here. Wait, this is so much fun! I am... I'm actually running as Sonic right now. <laughs> oh. But yeah, Crisis City is still uh, the best level in the game, in my opinion. And also very fast paced, there's so much chaos going on here. For all the characters, I really think this is the best. Like, it has to be the best balance. And then, um, what to say. Uh, for all- even Blaze the Cat has a really good balance, I mean, she's obviously the best character to play as. She has all the abilities to, act to attack her enemies. Well, oh, okay, uh, gotta be careful. And she's and she still goes fast. I mean, she has that ability where she just turn around like a tornado, a fire tornado, and she still goes fast. That's how I really want it to be when I do combat, especially in the Sonic game. I mean, whoa, 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 whoa! That was so so close. I just sort of stopped in the air, but this time I wasn't screwed. Now, should I just risk and use the Chaos Form again? I don't know. And before that, I'm gonna to take this ring here and let's go, baby. Let's get moving! <laughs> Man, doing that, doing that voiceover is really hard. I mean, your voice, I mean, your throat is just getting so right. Ouch. Really tried to do that in lightning, in light speed dash. But also, I did heard that YouTube is going to change itself. Like, there's that, there's that um, adults, the adult videos and kid videos. But I really don't like that rule at all. I mean, I have, I mean, I have to change my videos so that I have to make it to for kids because it's a, because those are video games. I mean, if I do it that way, I've heard you can't get likes or. There can't be any comments, so this is actually this is like they're downgrading themselves and at the same time just 
making all the possibilities of watching videos uh, more limited, especially for kids. I mean, if I were a kid and heard all about that, I'll just turn my account to, to 18 already, and then I'll have all the ac access, but I don't think all the kids learn about that yet, especially when they are completely new to the internet. They just do everything the parent says, and just turn it into whatever their ages are. That is not 18 or above. What? Oh man, I really hate this. I really thought I could hit the enemies. What? But anyways, I really don't like the, the new rule that Copa uh, wants to make. And that was because that YouTube um, just recently uh, got some bills that cost them a lot of money. So that's why they have to do this. I don't know if it's because they're victims or they just want to protect themselves, but either way, man. I really don't like how YouTube is going to change. So, what I want to do here is to complete my my Let's Plays of Slide 2 and Sonic the Hitchhiker 2 for the sick before that happens. I've heard they're going to officially change that in the 9th, the 9th December. Or, I mean, uh, December the 9th. Oh, how would they say it? I mean, where I come from, we say the opposite. <laughs> so, yeah. So, I don't know if my... I don't know if I'm ever going to stop or keep on making videos because... My if if they're going to be like that and my video is going to be for kids, then that means my channel won't be able to grow anymore. Because how would I get my how would I get subscription if um, my videos can't even get the recommendation? That's one of the problems too. I mean, us smaller YouTubers we're screwed. We're screwed because of those damn rules. I'm not into that. Luckily, there's a way you can actually change that, hopefully, uh, by doing, by actually doing some comments, uh, a very civil comment, or else they won't take it seriously. That um, if you make one a very good, um, what to say, a message to them, they may actually uh, not change it. Then maybe YouTube can actually be more serious for once and just change things themselves for the good way instead of the bad. Seriously. So yeah, I really hope this is not the end for me and YouTube, because I the first time I ever watched YouTube, that was when I was around 10, no, 9 years old. That was when I was around the third grade, and I really love all the videos I've, I've watched. I mean, they were so entertaining, I laughed like <laughs> over an hour or so. Oh no, I'm taking a lot of damage. And I, I really love all those videos they keep bringing up. Like, the, what's your first, what's the first video you ever saw in in YouTube? The first one I ever saw that was uh, that was actually Funny Mario. If you just want uh, write Funny Mario in the search, you will find it because it is such a popular. It was such a popular YouTube uh, YouTube video on in its time. And I watched it like all the many, many times. Everything about Mario that is so funny. And yeah, I just couldn't stop laughing. So yeah, search um, search for the Mario and then you'll find it. I promise you, you'll laugh so hard. Okay, now we're at the third, no actually fourth section. Okay, let's just take them down. Wait, what? Okay, it looks like he's just some sort of fell down like a rock again. Or like metal steel. Wait, what's the difference between steel and metal? There. Oh, don't fall down, don't fall down. Whew, that was close. And one of my other one of the other videos I watched, that was Kobana Minecraft 4 6. I actually mean it. He was the reason I ever wanted to do some Let's Plays video like him. Even though some of my qualities was very very low at, at that time. That was when I was around 12 when I first time saw his videos. I think it was Super, New Super Mario Brothers U. I mean, I mean, it, a game that's suddenly in HD? I have New Super Mario Brothers for the DS. My, my games just didn't look that good. I have to play it right now. 
But you know, I never had a Wii U, uh, Wii U console or any other Wii, Wii N Nintendo Wii. Okay, what to say? Nintendo home consoles. So I'm really, really excited to actually find one myself because then I can finally play a Nintendo game in HD. Yep, that's true. I'm not going to buy Nintendo Switch yet because I find it. I still find it very expensive. I don't want to um, waste up all my money on those games on sixty dollars. Because knowing Nintendo, they're going to keep it up, keep it like that for for a decade. Uh, so big that you want to burn to a crisp? Or just say hedgehog? Burn to a, a crispy hedgehog? Hmm, so tasty. Almost like a chili dog. <laughs> Anyways. This is one of those cool, cool sexes right there where you're just grinding. Just next to the fire tornado. That just shows how badass Shadow Weaver really is. Oh, that was not my plan, but okay, I'll take it. Okay, I'm almost to the goal. Can I please get to the goal, please? Okay, I'm gonna take him down. Yes! I landed my kick. My awesome shadow kick. Got it. Come on, come on, yeah! And I reached the goal! Wow, that took me over 7 minutes? Oh wow. Oh, I'm still getting S rank! Cool! Perfect. Perfect! Yes, it really is perfect. And that's because you're Shadow. You're always perfect. Funny. Sonic Shadow and Silver starts with an S. And what's the rank? S. But I can still... I'll actually make this way up to, to the Iblis 2 fight because... Like I said, I do want to complete the uh, pl complete the last place as fast as possible because if if they really want to change this YouTube forever, then I'm going to end the whole thing with a bang. Ah, <laughs> my precious Chaos Emerald, you are also beautiful. Your mysterious brilliance. Omega? What's he doing here? It seems he's in standby mode. What could have possibly happened to create this future? Yes. This is Rouge. Understood. We'll be there in a minute. It looks like Sonic and his friends have found something, too. Let's go. It's not like we can do anything for him now. Yeah. You guys are so slow. Look. A Chaos Emerald! You've already found one! Well now, I may not look it, but I'm a real treasure hunter. Unlike a certain Echidna I know. What? Heh! <laughs> Have you guys discovered anything? Um, yeah. I received a signal indicating there's a Chaos Emerald here, but... You mean we've got to go through there? If you don't like it, you can stay here. You've got to be kidding. Don't be late. Same to you. Again with the disc shadow, that was so edgy. You know, you can almost have cut his career. <laughs> Anyways, let's go to, to Flame Core, also one of my favorite levels in this game. I mean, everything about the 200 years, they just turned this... They just turned the game even better. 
Now, I don't know if it's actually changed that much because uh, this, this and Sonic's level, uh, Flame Core, I don't think they changed too drastically on it. I think it's one of those few stages they didn't change much about that. Yeah, Chaos Emeralds, they have unlimited powers. They say that if you collect all of them, the miracle is supposed to happen. And the miracle is, if you snap, half the universe's life forms are going to die. <laughs> I I know, I, I actually didn't watch the Infinity War yet, but uh, I did turn one of those things that it, if, if uh, the Thanos actually snaps, half the, almost half the universe's life form is actually dying. And even the superheroes actually died, and that's crazy to know that the movie actually ended this way. But I actually, and then I actually watched the Avengers Endgame before, uh, event, what to say, Infinity War. So, yeah, I just bored myself in this sort of way. But like, all I, all I needed to know was that the heroes actually died, so it didn't impact me that much. Not that much. Oh, more monsters. She's a cage. Oh, wait. Now I'm gonna use this form, and then I can teleport and attack. I'm gonna do the same here. This is actually a pretty awesome ability. This way, I don't need to wait for... Okay, what I said before, just tap the X button, and then you don't have to fall down like like a bit like I did before. I mean, if you actually hold the button in the air, and then you sort of uh, hit them in the wrong, what to say, rhythm? A uh, rhythm? I don't know what to say. Then you may actually fall down, and then there's no way you can recover from that. Oh, right, I actually completed it. Oh, man, almost thought I was going to fall again. Okay, like here. If you actually hold the button like now, do you see that? Then you actually fall down. But that's because I don't have a target to, to teleport to. I love this ability. Okay, there's more enemies here. Okay, more worms. Got him. Now all I need to do is not screw up when I go to the other section. Or another... Just get to the other side. Just tap the button carefully. And attack! Yes! Okay, that's good. Whoa, I didn't hit... Wait, the spring! Yes! Okay, I actually hit the spring. That was close. Okay. Wow, I'm actually playing like a pro here. Okay, my rings are splitting up. <laughs> okay, this is the last time. Yes! Man, I actually didn't screw up this time. Woohoo! Oh. Man, I'm so glad. Now, to get into the cavern. Do you actually hear the music in the cavern version of the Flame Core? It's really good. And I suppose we didn't actually hear the full verse, uh, the whole thing. Or may, or perhaps I didn't really uh, notice the whole, the whole soundtrack because it really does sound very sweet. I mean, just hearing all the soundtracks and all the story, I really do feel like that the team actually put a lot of effort into this game. It's just because the at the deadline that really stressed them to actually fail that that badly. 
So at the same time, I feel bad for them because they did use a lot of time, but because because there's so many odds against them, like that is not for the PS3, the launch title, and many things else, and that this game actually feels so badly, and that's really that's really a shame because. The way I'm playing right now, I actually do like this game again, just a bit. I mean, I don't know what to say because you, you people may think I'm crazy, but the more I play it, the more I actually kind of like it in, in a weird way. I mean, if the glitch is absolutely terrible, like they're stopping me for no, uh, stopping me even though I'm really doing good, then that's where they're really crossing the line, but. Even though it sometimes happens, I feel like there's a lot of good things happening to me right now. Like I'm actually playing really good at this, uh, the uh, Sonic 06 or 2006, and that's why I don't really feel so stressful about it. So take it or leave it. That's just how I feel. If you have a lot of skills, then nothing is gonna kill. That's just a rhyme I just made up long years ago. Right now, I don't really know where the switch is, so let's just kind of go and try to find it. Oh, it's right next to the door. Oh, foolish me. Foolish fool. Got it. Okay, now to go. It only took you a, about a half a minute, dude. Okay, gotta be really careful. This, the levels that exit kind of changed, and now we're gonna play as Rouge the Bat. Now I don't want to do. I'm not gonna do that glitch again where we actually just kind of glitch into the wall because I only did this because Knuckles never got a level to finish himself. So I'm just gonna play as Rouge the Bat normally. So what we do here is just hit all of the light balls here, around this area, and then Shadow can go to the other side. Okay, two more. Whoa, how did I do that? I just sort of came up, but okay, thank you, I'm gonna need that for the extra boost. Okay, just beating all the bullies. Take that, bullies! And then I'm gonna go this way. Nothing can stop the almighty Shadow the Hedgehog. I'm so itchy, just looking at me, you guys are gonna take half the damage. Okay, hear the scream. <laughs> that, that really doesn't sound like Shadow's gonna make that scream, but he did. <laughs> well, I completed the level with style again. Another S for me. Perfect. And now we're gonna face this long ass uh, boss fight. It plays too. Hmm. If they actually going to change the rule of YouTube, then what's gonna happen to a previous YouTube uh, YouTube videos that has nothing to do with it? Uh, we just going to change all of them to children or adults? I don't know. All I just need to hope is that it never happens. Because what they're thinking right now is very, very stupid. I found a Chaos Emerald. Don't touch it! <gasps> what? What's this? <laughs> I know what that is. It's it's Garatina, the lava version. 
<laughs> Those fireballs ain't gonna scare me. I'm just gonna take a normal walk. I mean, this is just a wait and see battle. You all, you can't do anything unless you get closer to it or or it's coming closer to you. Okay, can I actually go this far? I do remember that I have to go this way. I'm just gonna have to wait. All I'm gonna do is just take a little walk. I'm so bored. Alright, gonna do that and kaboom! It's just kind of weird that he's just standing still while this orb is just floating up and down. Okay, it's coming. And then attack. Right there. Run the nugget. Whoa, I'm falling! A random spring. Okay, can I, can I actually get to the light before it falls down? No, I can't. I'll, rent. I'll not risk that. Also, it doesn't really make any difference because you have, you still have to wait until the pillars are falling, until, until the pillars are coming right down to this path. Also, for the first time ever, I played Sonic Boom Rise of Lyric, the demo version of the Wii U, and boy, the characters are talking way too much, and I don't find this. And although the po the puzzles are there as a Sonic game, they're not even that complicated. Then I still kind of like this game, just not that much. But I actually do want to try the the full version of Sonic Boom one day. I swear that. I mean, the only Sonic Boom game I ever have that is Sonic Boom Fire and Ice, which is supposedly the last Sonic Boom game ever made. I mean, it's been three years now, and we haven't heard anything about Sonic Boom. Not even the show. So, Season 2 and Fire and Ice may be the last breath of the series. Although, I really, really, really like the Sonic Boom series. And probably because of Cartoon Network. I don't know where it's actually aired. I just saw it on YouTube. Then I don't think the I don't think this the the series will ever get a chance because it's probably because of the games that uh, that is really gotten downgraded uh, for most people in the first place. So yeah, the the this because because of those broken games, this series has gotten down to to the to the death path uh, ever since ever since. And Shadow Boy, man, you have really turned to a bully for something in the series. I mean, you just wanted to fight him just because you can. You have been a disgrace for the whole Hedgehog kind. And for that, you shall perish. I mean, what the heck? Uh, is there something called the Hedgehog Clan now because they're Echidna Clans? That's just rubbish. Shadow, you talking rubbish. Okay, this is just gonna be the last time. Yeah, he's really not that tough, but just wait till you see the third version of him. Now, I wonder how it is on the 360 version. Is it less broken? Because I... I did heard that the demo version was the better version of the full version. So... What gifts? What? No! I lost my rings! Ouch. Oh, I did ex... I remember... It's... Oh, wait a minute. Okay, okay. Okay, just hit the ball, and it's actually gonna crumble right up to you. Ex... But it's not here. Yes! And now I'm gonna attack him. 
Wow, that ended so fast. <laughs> I mean, the way it ended, it was just kind of anticlimactic. He's like, ha, check this out. And that was it for Iblis 2. Never come back again. Especially when in front of front the Edgelord. So yeah, this is gonna be the last part of the walkthrough, people, so... <laughs> I'm not gonna end this yet, just what- you should just watch the chaos control scene. I guess that was all right. Um, okay, maybe if I didn't lose my rings, I would at least get the E rank. I was so close to the A rank! Dude! Oh well. Can't win them all every time. Chaos Control! Control!